on the side of their trailer they have on there the best barbecue in texas hey what's going on everybody today i went to a barbecue food trailer called real tips and catering now this particular uh, barbecue trailer uh, they don't have a specific spot so you have to follow them on uh, facebook to find out where exactly they're going to be at and what time they're going to be there but today i decided to try their four meat uh, barbecue plate and on that four meat barbecue plate i have sausage pulled pork rib tips rib tips and brisket and along with the uh four meat barbecue plate i also got two sides and those two sides is macaroni and cheese which looks good i can't wait to try it and also collard greens can't wait to try them collard greens too so i'm not going to take up too much more of your time let's go ahead and get started on this uh four meat rib plate or this four meat barbecue plate from rib tips and catering I'm gonna go ahead and start with the sausage first. So let's go ahead and try this sausage. Let's see what these sausages taste like. Mm. Okay, the sausage is, is uh, seasoned well. Tastes great. I like the barbecue sauce that's on, on top of the sausage. I'm really liking this sausage. Let's go ahead and try another piece of sausage here. Yeah, this sausage got it going on. But I don't want to get too full with the sausage. So let's go ahead and just try this pulled pork. Let's see what this pulled pork tastes like. But oh, this pulled pork got it going on too. Let's go ahead. Let's put a little bit more barbecue sauce on there. On this pulled pork. Mix that sauce up in there a little bit. Yeah. This pulled pork is on point. But I tell you what makes the pulled pork and the sausage so far is this barbecue sauce. I don't know what they're making this barbecue sauce with, but this barbecue sauce is on point. I don't want to get too full. Let's go ahead and just dig into these rib tips. As you can see, the rib tip is nice and meaty. It looks tender and looks good. Let's go ahead and let's bite into this rib tip to see what we're working with. Oh, this rib tip is fire. The meat is seasoned well. It's tender. It's like fall off the bone. I don't know what they're doing <laughs> with these rib tips, but these rib tips are on fire. And again, this barbecue trailer is called Rib Tips and Catering Barbecue Trailer. You need to follow these guys on Facebook See where they're at, so you can get some of these rib tips. These rib tips is fire. I'm loving these rib tips. Again, they're tender, fall off the bone, season well. Just put some of this some more of this barbecue sauce on here. Oh. I'm loving this rib tip. I can't say enough about these barbecue rib tips. Before I get too full, let's go ahead and let's attack this brisket. Let's see what this brisket tastes like. And I can tell you already, it's tender, it's moist. This brisket is on point too. But I am loving this barbecue sauce. Put a little bit more of the sauce on this brisket. I'm gonna have to tell y'all right now, everything on this full meat barbecue plate is fire. The sausage is fire. Go ahead and dip it some more in this barbecue sauce. The pulled pork.
It's fine. Real tip. Let's dip it in this barbecue sauce. It's fine. And last but not least, just brisket. I tell you right now, they give you plenty of meat. And that's what I'm like. Dip this biscuit and this barbecue sauce. Oh. I'm going to have to tell y'all again. Every meat that I have on this full meat barbecue plate is fire. And this barbecue sauce, it just gives it the extra fire. With that, let's go ahead and hit these sides. I have the macaroni and cheese and the collard greens. So let's pull this over here to the side and let's start with this macaroni and cheese. Dig in there, let's get it. See what this macaroni and cheese tastes like. I think macaroni and cheese is pretty good. I like the cheesiness of it. It's not necessarily fire, but it's good macaroni and cheese. I highly recommend this macaroni and cheese. Let's get on over to these collard greens. Let's see what these collard greens working with. Go ahead and stir them up. Got plenty of meat in there. Smell good. Let's see what we're working with. Let's get some meat in there to get some of these greens. Now, the greens is the greens is pretty good. And I really don't have a gripe about the greens. They just have a smoky a flavor to it that I don't really care for in my collard greens. Now, that's not to say that these collard greens, that anything is wrong with these collard greens. Oh no. They taste real good. Has plenty of meat in there. And you can tell it's seasoned well. I'm just not a big fan of the smoky taste. And that may not necessarily be the greens, but that might be just the meat with the smoky taste. But these greens is on point. Macaroni and cheese is on point. The brisket, the rib tips, the pulled pork, the sausage, everything here is on point. On the side of their trailer, they have on there the best barbecue in Texas. I'm not sure whether they the best barbecue place in Texas or not, but they up there. And with that, this is Stu, your food delivery junkie. I'm out. Peace. Cause now it's like 55 quid for my phone bill And a tether for my bus pass too